Alrighty, we are back with Dwarf Fortress! With a new, new video card and new monitor and everything, so hooray! Uh, uh, the old monitor blowing out kind of explained why it smelled like something was on fire! Hooray! So, we're back. There'll be multiple jump cuts in this episode, but we're back because there's a dead dude. <laughs> Just, oh no, he's not dead. I thought this guy was dead, but it doesn't say there's a body there. Oh, maybe someone's carrying something. Maybe someone's carrying a dead dude. Because someone just died in here. Let's expand this. There we go. So, who is hauling something? It doesn't actually say. Hmm. Because it clearly looks like there's a dead guy there. One, two, three. Oh, so that guy's actually just alive. The guy that looks dead there is alive. But uh, we're back because this guy here has, um... Got into a berserk rage. So, he's lost his mind. It's not going very well for him, though. Because if we look here... Uh, what's this guy? Yeah, he's probably the hunter. Well, he punched the bone carver. Got hit by a crossbow bolt. Artery's been... broken. And he keeps getting shot by crossbow bolts. Right in the middle, of course, of the dining hall, where everybody's like terribly depressed and unhappy. Oh my god, look at them all gang up on him. Is he dead already? Molten liquid chiroya? Let's look that up. Okay, so that's a. <laughs> that's not what I was looking for. Uh, Dwarf Fortress Wiki. I don't have a clue what that is, because it doesn't show up on the wiki. So, this is interesting. I'm assuming that must be you. <coughs> so what is this? Molten liquid chariot. It's an instrument. Made of molten liquid cloth. Molten liquid. So how does that thing work if it's, like, a liquid? How do you... Uh, how? Okay. Okay, I'm not sure how an instrument works when it's in liquid form. But whatever. Whatever, you're a bit special. Oof. <sighs> so he's dead now. Look at that. Being punched. Multiple arteries going out. Bites him in the head. Bites him in the lower body. Scratches. Punched. And then Miner gets him in the head with a steel pick, and the severed part sails off in an arc. Because that's what the miner does. He murders things. And now everybody in there is going to be in shock from having seen someone die just right in front of their very eyes. <sighs> so now, even more people are unhappy. 
And I'm pretty sure we lost yet another member of the military. So this is going to... The recovery from what happened is still ongoing. And very much problematic. But hey, jump cut. We'll see what happens next. I also have a cold, so my nose is running. But it, listening back on the recordings, it always seems like my nose is running. Because I'm always fucking sniffling. It's always fun. Oh well. So yep, jump cut time. Oh, we are back. Why are we back? Oh, well, because the elves have decided to be twats and show up. This is a bad time for that, because um, I've got to get your bodies out of the river, and I was going to do that when the water was frozen. So, <laughs> A, move, C, move, D, move. We also are pretty much rather low on um, our squads, because they're not very much full anymore. So yeah, you need to have your ranks rebuilt, so to say. And since you're supposed to be the best squad, you're going to be kind of like um, taken from the other squads. Adequate. I'm looking for better. Competent. Skilled. Cool. Here's hoping you don't freak out. You're skilled. You're adept. You're also adept. You're a grandmaster. And you're professional, so you're going in there too. Accomplished. Okay, so I think that's everything. So we've rebuilt that squad. Look at you, you have nobody. <laughs> uh, put the ranger in there. Put that ranger in there. Ooh, someone's competent. Peddler, you're going in there. Hunter, you're going in. Hunter, you're going in. Hunter, you're going in. You're already in the squad. You're a novice. You go in. You have nobody. You really have nobody at the moment. I might not be able to fill you with anybody. There's an adept that isn't in there with anyone, so you get to go in. Competent, but you're already in one. Competent, but you're already in one. Competent, but you're already in one. Novice, but you're already in one. Ooh, someone here. Novice, but is not in a squad. And I think this might be the end of this squad. Getting anybody. Okay, so they're 
kind of. They've got a strength now. Military. Do I want to do an alert? So I can open the gate and lure the elves in so they can get... Who's fighting and where and why? They're fighting. Don't know why, but they are. So someone's probably going to have to have the... Recover the wounded again. But at least they stopped quickly. Ah, <laughs> eh, traitor's throwing a tantrum. And... They're still fighting. That put an end to your tantrum really quick, didn't it? Yes, you're throwing a tantrum. We know that. I think he's possibly knocked out. So yeah, this is a bit of a problem. We've got to fight elves with a bunch of dwarves that are perpetually pissed off at each other. isn't exactly brilliant. How are we doing? We do have drink. Mortally afraid. Wonder why. Military alerts. Emergency. Trying to get this place to limp along just a little bit further. There's people fighting some more. Oh, it's the elves. They're fighting a donkey. Okay, so the squads are being assembled. They're where they pretty much need to be. literally have to hope they come towards the door. Zip, some more elves have been found. Not a huge surprise in that regard. There's no livestock over here anymore to lure the elves in, which is a bit of a problem. So, I think we'll continue with the jump cut for a little while, and we'll just see what happens. Look, there's more of them. There's a shocker. There's more! They didn't suffer heavy casualties with their last raid, so they come up with more guys. I'm tempted just to rebuild the uh, melee squad as well. Let's just do that now. Grab this, move that over to the other screen, go to military, I want strength, sort by strength. It was, everybody was 90 or better before, no. but now we're going to have to go down to probably at least the 80s to fill up that squad. Who's fighting and why? Yeah, they're fighting the donkey. Trying to kill the donkey. Downside is I don't actually know how many elves there are out there. Look how much effort they have to expend on killing a donkey because they don't have real weapons. And this is good. Let them use up all their ammunition on the donkey. That's yeah, pretty much perfectly acceptable to me. So, we're going to rebuild the melee squad as well, right now. 
vacant. Who is the strongest dwarf on the map? That would be M M Bill. That would be you. So let's not actually have you there. <laughs> okay, so who's the next strongest one? Sure has. Not in there already. Shorest. So we find Shorest. Oh, really? Oh, you're easy to find. Because you're a 95. You're also the traitor. So the next one is Tun, who is not on the list yet. So where's Tun? As long as you're not on one of the archer squads. Hmm. What is their mood? That's another good question. Ton. You're alright. Because you got your fantastic bedroom. So, ton, ton, ton. Where are you, ton? Where is she? No, oh, you're part of a Mark Store squad, so it can't be you. Earth. Where is Earth? Now, oh, which ton? Yeah, you're part of the Twin Oaks, and you're adequate, so yeah, we're not taking you out. So after Tun is Aerith. Where is Aerith? That's E-Rush, not Aerith. Aerith. Est? Nope, Unibada. So wrong, Aerith. Granted, the name doesn't always match. Which is always annoying. If the name doesn't quite match and all that wonderful fun stuff. I wish there was a way to sort it in here so you go strongest people only at the top of the list and then pick them that way. Broker. So what is Aerith over here? You're a broker? Can I see your profession? Let me see your profession. You're a weaponsmith. So yeah, not you then. We can search for weaponsmiths because there ain't that many weaponsmiths. Mark's Dwarf, ah, you might actually be in one of the other squads already. <coughs> I'm not seeing anything. Lovely. Oh, that's why. Already in. I'm a dumbass. Kib! Next in the list is... Really unhappy. So we're not recruiting Kib. Dishmab. Dishmab and anything else. No. Dishmab. We must find you. Dishmab, where is Dishmab? Finding the Dishmab. <coughs> you know, my cat's crying upstairs. 
Dish mad. Really? There you are. You're a peasant. That's actually not a bad thing. So after Dishmeb is Domas. Domas already in something. Domas is. After Domas is Lorbam. Where is Lorbam? Lorbam in something already? No. So now we get to find Lorbam. Lorbam, where are you? Lorbam, Lorbam, where is Lorbam? There is Lor, but that's not Lorbam. There we go. Traitor. Uh, yep, this is you. After Lorbam is Cog. Cog. Cog anywhere else? No. And Cog is not overly depressed. So Cog, we shall find you. As we rebuild our shitty army. Cog, where are you, Cog? Really, seriously, there's only a certain number of people here. Where the hell is Cog? Um, C-O-G. How hard could it be to f Oh, he's a child. And after Cog is Shorast, who is probably going to kill himself. Because he's currently really unhappy. Very unhappy. Sunk into a depression. Okay, so Kubuk. Or, yeah, Kubuk. I'm pretty sure you're already in something. Nope. 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 We can find Kubuk then and put him on the list. Kubuk, Kubuk, where the hell are you? You're not a child, so you should be in the list. Of course, it's Dwarf Fortress. We should be able to use Child Fort. No, uh, child, <laughs> child soldiers. Yeah. Weaponize the children. Yeah. Cadol, Cadol, Kosoth. Really? Oh no, Kubuk is a child too. Damn it! Uh, okay, fine. Fath, Fath, you're not too particularly unhappy. Are you already in another squad? No. Damn it, you are. No more. You're not a child. As the list goes down and down and down. As we get weaker and weaker people into an all metal armor squad, so they get really freaking slow and can't keep up. That just seems brilliant. So you're a farmer. Boom. After that is... Oh no. You should be okay. You shouldn't all be depressed either. Where are you in the list? It's Olin, not Oh no. You are not a child. Good. Another Olin. On all. But I'm looking for... Oh, not a U. That's Obok. I'm looking for an L, not a... Well, there's a couple letters wrong in that one. There you are. You're a weaponsmith. Lovely. Okay. After you is Alath. Uh, making sure you're not in something else. No, you're not. So now we find Al. Well, you're right there. That was easy. So lowest strength now in that squad is Alath, who is very happy, which is good. Ecstatic, and her strength is 85. So that is as low as we go now with that. 
Not, um, brilliant. But hey. It's a start. At least we have a full melee squad now. Okay, so... I guess that'll be today's episode. We got elves outside the fort. We got some people still being treated for wounds. Down here. <laughs> What's wrong with the captain of the guard? Oh, he doesn't have any rooms for one thing. Health, village stand lost. You got some torn open things. Just need suturing and dressing. You'll be fine. So Captain Lagarde needs his crap. So we'll assign you some crap. Captain Lagarde requires an office, quarters, dining room. So here we go. This is currently to the mayor. Mayor, who has this? Why does the mayor have two bedrooms? Current owner, nobody. Why do you have that? Whose room is this? Currently, no one owns that. Which means... This... that, and this will be to the Captain of the Guard. Captain of the Guard. No, this isn't going to work. Free. It's supposed to be a guest room, too. I don't know why you have this. Lore, are you a particular thing? Lore, 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 lore. No, lore is nothing. You people do not get this bedroom. Assign bed. Captain of the Guard. Boom. You! This is your dining room. Captain of the Guard. And this is your office. Captain of the Guard. And now, Captain of the Guard has what he requires. Good. Mayor demands a month. Yeah, good luck with that one. Can I actually make a muscle muscle shell throne? I really don't think I can. Shell. No, I can't. Here? Can I here make Nope, that's just throne. You want a muscle shell throne which I sh seriously cannot make. Yeah, you're going to be perpetually pissed off. The perpetually pissed off fucking mayor. I don't know. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. We kind of rebuilt our squads. And now we got loads of fucking elves outside. Because why not? That's how this shit works. Stupid elves. I want to go clean up the outside, but I can't. Because there's elves. I've been making floodgates to block off the rivers here, and down there, and up north, and leaving the output free on the in the west. But I can't. Why? Because there's elves! There's probably a lot of elves. Stupid elves! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Maybe we'll be shooting some of them. I don't know. Thank you all for watching my video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to hit that stupid little bell thing that YouTube has added, because otherwise you won't get notifications of any new videos if you su subscribe. Also, follow me on Twitter, at GenJeft, as I always have my video updates on there, so you will never miss a video if you're on my Twitter feed, because they'll all be posted. And any other dumbass comment I make as well. So, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.